Today I'm going to show you how to highlight a moving object in a video and add fun GIF elements using shortcut. Make sure to watch until the end because I will also show you how to download animated GIF files for free. Hi, I'm Sanketa and welcome to Vertical Darts. I have this basketball game clip where I want to highlight Stephen Curry making his shot. We will add an oval shape that follows him on the court. Additionally, we will include a few fun elements like an animated arrow and animated lines to make the video more engaging. First, let's add an oval shape. Go ahead and create a new video track. Then, go to open other and select animation. This window will appear where you can change the duration. I'll set it to 5 seconds since my clip is short and I don't want the shape to stay the whole time. Now click open. This will launch the Glaxinimate app. To draw an oval, I will select the ellipse tool. Under tool options, make sure layer is selected. Since we only need an outline and not a solid shape, I won't select the fill option. Just check box for the stroke. If you don't see the tool options window, go to view and under views, scroll down the tool options at the bottom. Now let's draw the shape. To make adjustments, go to timeline. Under the ellipse folder, you will see the ellipse shape. Expand the drop down menu. Then expand stroke to change the color and adjust the width. I will change the color to red. And adjust its width to 10. Once you are done, click save, then close the application. Now back in shortcut, you will see the oval shape. Add it to the timeline. The next step is animating it to follow our subject. Click edit to reopen it in Glaxinimate. This time your video clip will be visible. Move the play hair to the beginning of the timeline and adjust the shape size and position. Once you are satisfied, click the record button to create a keyframe. Then immediately turn it off. Move the play head to where you want the animation to end. I will stop it right when Steph Curry makes his shot. Click record again and reposition the shape. Then turn record off. Let's check if the shape properly follows Steph Curry. If it falls behind, simply click record and adjust the position as needed. Repeat this wherever necessary. Looks good. Now let's save and close the application. Perfect. We will trim any unnecessary parts.
If you are enjoying this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Back to the tutorial. Now let's add some fun elements like an animated arrow and animated lines. I have already added these GIF files. You can download free animated files from Lottie Files website. Let's find an animated arrow. This one looks great. You can even change its color. Choose the format. I will select GIF. Then click export and save. And that's how you can get free animated GIF files. Move the play here to where you want to place the animation. Add a new video track. To adjust its size, apply the size, position and rotate filter. Resize and rotate as needed. Since the clip is short, I will copy and paste it to reuse it. Looks good. I will also add animated lines. I will add the size, position and rotate filter to adjust its size and position. Yet to score. 0 for 4 from the floor. Curry pulls up from 30 feet. Around and down for Curry. Try this in your next YouTube video and let me know how it turns out. I hope this video was helpful. Check out more shortcut tutorials on my channel. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.